going on guys? Um, I really wish I thought of this video on Halloween, but I just didn't have the thought. Had I had a thought making it on Halloween, I would have made it on Halloween. But I had a thought now, so I'm making it now. I hope you guys like it. So October 31st, 2017 is just so fucking important to Little Peep. I'm going to explain it to you guys why in one second. Um, he would be on the Come Over When You're Sober tour um, towards the final extension leg of it. Um, the fact that it's October 31st and it's Peep's birthday and he's turning 21 and he's in New York in his own backyard on this day is very, very important. Um, I don't think the stars could have aligned any better for Peep. Uh, he really considered his fan base to be like his extended family. So the fact that he got to spend his last birthday with a sold out crowd, um, his friends on stage, and the people he loved just around him. And I'm sure he got to spend time with his family too because he was already in New York. I just think it's a very beautiful chapter. Um, in the final chapter of Peep's life. Um, so many fascinating um, chapters have taken place in this book. Um, this is just one moment that I want to highlight for you guys. So the fact that this tour ended up stopping in his backyard on such an important day is just mind-blowing. Um, Peep drank a lot of Hennessy at this show, but that was a normal show. He drank Hennessy at every show, but the fact that he was legally now um, 21 years old, I'm sure played a little factor in it. Um, his Halloween costume was very interesting too, to say the least. It was like a cross between a Michael Myers jumpsuit and like a Misfits face paint. If you've ever seen that photo floating around, there's like this photo that a lot of fans just consider like an emo photo of Peep. It's actually from this concert, um, the Halloween concert at the Highland Ballroom in New York. That's where that photo is from. So this show is just so interesting. Uh, I'm going to leave a link in the description because apparently this show was incredible. There's just some kind of magical energy and vibe and aura in the air that night. Um, it being Halloween, Pete be turning 21, him being drunk, everything going perfect at his life in this point. I mean, Pete was on the top of the world. So just imagine, you know, him having a lot of money, him being financially secure and being stable and having his family so close to him he probably felt so secure in this moment we can only imagine um, I just think it's a it's a moment that's very important and it captures a lot of beauty there's not a lot of film of this concert but then again rain filmed every concert peep ever did so we know that the entire concert is on film it's just very interesting what the what rain is gonna do with all that footage um, so we got to get to the show itself because uh, from what I've gathered, it was an incredible set list. Um, Peep would play a lot of old songs, and he would play a lot of new songs. And the reviews that fans left um, from this show, I'll leave in the link, you guys can read them. But apparently, Peep was fucking incredible this night. Um, some fans said his performance was heaven-like. Other fans said it was just insane to see a musician come to New York and fucking rip it up like this and really just blow the fucking house down. Um, if you guys know, New York has always been kind of a tough crowd. Um, they've always been a little bit less embraceive and a little naive to accepting a musician right off the bat. Um, it's just always been a theme uh, amongst the New York audience. You kind of have to earn them. You, you really have to... Uh, earn their love, um, but so Peep, to really just show up and fucking steal it like that, is, I just think it's incredible, um, apparently Bexy was really good at this show too, a lot of fans left good rave reviews about Bexy's um, short little set, cause you know, he would open up for Peep, so, I just think it's so fascinating, um, I thought his costume was fascinating, and just the fact that Peep was born on Halloween night in Saints Day is just so incredible to me, um, and he, his costume was just so creative. You guys know Peep was just really, um, he was really just awesome when it came to customizing and accessorizing his own apparel. So I'm sure he was just so excited. Um, but I just wanted to make a quick video on how it's so critical and how awesome it was. Um, two, two weeks from now, Peep would pass away untimely. So for the stars to align, for him to end up in New York on Halloween, on his birthday, in his backyard, in front of a huge sold out crowd. It's just so insane. And it's a very special night in Peep's life. So I'd be a fool not to highlight it, be a fool not to discuss it. Um, 
Pete is a guy that will never forget, but at least we have moments like this. And I hope you guys enjoy the video. And I just wanted to shed a little light on the night that Pete performed at the Highland Ballroom in New York. Girl, I don't 